Did you just toot? Oh my god, dude. Jeez. Oh god. It keeps getting worse. Oh, barf, dude. Hello and welcome, Dirty William here, back with more of Skyforge. Um, I recorded some gameplay earlier, and unfortunately I didn't record my voice, so that sucked. Uh, but then I recorded some more footage, and that footage just sucked. So now I'm back to it again, and my son is going to watch me play for a little bit. Maybe he can uh, ask me some questions about the game. Uh, maybe we can figure it out together, because I honestly am lost. That noise, the horrible noise you hear, is him scraping a chair across the floor. Okay. So here's my guy, right here. Does that look like Daddy a little bit? Kind of. Okay, to open the style room, press escape and find the appropriate tab. Uh, style room, right up here. So, these are the different clothes that I have. Here's a holiday costume. Look at my big old gut. Big old flappy gut. Okay, which one looks cool, William? Uh, I think go to that looks like Elvis Presley, Wait, which is cool. Go to go to that that one. This one? Yeah. That looks Light like the power that. suit. Yeah. Okay, what colors do you think look good? Uh, I like. Uh, since I'm like a cryomancer, would the blue be cool? Or do you think the red and black? Since I have I that as my red and, black. red and black, I do too. Okay, so we're gonna go to save. <laughs> And um, I can put on glasses too. Oh, cool. Oh, look, I oh, look like a superhero. See my earring I've got? Oh, oh look at that. that. Oh, do, that. do that one? What yeah. about that? Eye patch. It'll be like Dirty Pirate William. <laughs> or do you like that better? I like that. Oh, he likes that better, kids. Like Bane. Like Bane. Yeah. I'm going to break Batman's back. Okay, so what do we need to do? Oh, I get, uh, I get to. I tried something on, look. And I hit F and I get a reward 500 credits. A uh, certain event that might be interesting. To you. Okay, so I need to go to the uh, Divine Observatory, which is um, over here. This little uh, diamond shape that is showing me where to go. If I mouse over that and hit space, I will go right to it. So this is where I need to go. So I'm going to use this and go to the Divine Observatory. I'm Bane. <laughs> I'm going to murder you. Find out who attacked everybody in the world. Okay. So, and over there, see, I mouse over that, hit space, and I'll run to the objective. So, hands off. Just clap, 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 and run. Clap and run. All right. Uh, connect. So we'll click join. Uh, group uh, difficulty is hard. Eh. We'll solo this thing. What are we afraid of? What are we afraid of, bub? Nope. We're afraid of mommy. That's what we're afraid of. We have to get to the main computer, so we can turn off the conveyor. Okay. Well, let's do that then. These people are talking to each other. Wow, it's like an open world! It's like a living open world! There's bad guys. Uh, let's uh, hit him with this. The what? Yeah, I shoot ice and stuff. I do ice, ice themed things. Now let's hit F. It says, yeah, I can still walk under this guy. Yeah, cool. Okay, well you guys are gonna go down. And, what's up? Oh, that was gnarly. There is an observer. Let's see what this number F, or number four does. Oh, it makes a, a fake me over there so they can attack that instead. That's interesting. Now they have a, a couple of other character classes that you can do right off the bat. One is a light binder, and I guess that one is more about healing and stuff. There's a boss. Yeah, I like I the light binder. Let's do that, and that.
your basic attacks charge up your little blue meter down there. That's kind of like your mana, I guess. I know, right? Oh, I just blasted all those guys. Two bits, he pieces. More monies. Did you just toot? Oh my god, dude. Jeez. Oh god. It keeps getting worse. Oh, barf, dude. Well, I knew. I knew because my nose hair just got fried. Jeez. Oh, there we go. Press E and do a finishing move. And that kill? I know, right? Oh my god, please don't toot again. That is seriously gross. Grosser than gross. More money dollars? They're gonna blow! Oh, another box. I got a ring of courage. So, let's see. Um, if I go to P and hit that, let's see, I have a ring of courage and uh, another ring of courage. Okay, plus 10, plus 6. So this one is better, I guess. And this gives me luck. What do I have here? That's luck also. So let's put that one on there. Impulse charge is activated. Occasional damage to bonus, probability, blah, blah, blah. Uh, the higher your spirit, the greater the bonus. Okay. Sounds cool in the game. So, I got a thing. It's a Reaper of Death! I have to use the control panels to disable the shield. Alright, so I killed that guy off. Uh, let's pick this up. What did I get? I got a shield. Which I can't really use. That's for a paladin. But that might be a thing to try out, is go from Cryomancer to Paladin now. Right? Um, how do I get out of this crazy place? Oh, press F to receive a reward. Quest completed. You were in the plans of Reapers of Death. Time 1402. So only six minutes above the curve. Uh, progress 100 out of 100. No modifiers. I got 35 of the blue things. Um, additional rewards. I got 21 particles of mastery. Okay, let's accept. And go into a loading screen of death. Uh, okay, let's finish. I guess she was done talking. Got a weapon booster, a broken weapon, a ritual ornament. Um, it's time to make sense of the blah, 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 blah. Uh, go to a broken weapon in your bag, which would be right here. And what do we do? Yeah, disassemble it. Do you want to disassemble it? Okay. Uh, rank 1 Enhancement Stone. By disassembling equipment, when you receive stones, 100 is subtracted from the credit limit. In exchange for credits in the market, the purchase is not counted towards the limit. Price of the market is variable. These are all words that I don't understand. So, um, I don't know what that does. Can I, do you drag and drop that over? How do you work? I don't know. I don't know how to do this. Okay, open your equipment window, click on the marked upgrade slot, then any available upgrade and select upgrade. So, we have to hit P. <laughs> And let's see, we have an upgrade slot. Ritual ornament? Oh no, here, upgrade slot. Weapon booster. No, we have a weapon booster. Um, this costs seven. Upgrade weapon booster. Why not? And we'll upgrade it again. So it's at 50%. Okay, I think that's going to do it for this episode because we're getting into territory that I don't understand. Oh, I will do this though at the very end. I'm going to click on this and unlock it. Boom. So now I get a plus seven to my luck. And now when I get some more of the red ones, I need 50 red ones to unlock that. Uh, whiteout creates a 12 yard radius uh, area. All enemies that enter take 12 to 15 damage every second. So it's like an AOE. So that is neat. And then we'll go around and da 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 So, all right, that is going to be it for this episode. Thank you all for watching. Until next time, this is Dirty William reminding you to do the dirty work.